Hey, <clears throat> my name is Greg Bentley, and I'm going to be talking to y'all about making the right choice. Now, I printed off all this, so this is supposed to help you learn that smoking or doing drugs in general is wrong. Now, I'm going to ask you one question. Which brain would you want? Do you want the top left, the top right, the bottom left, or the bottom right? Well, the middle one is the brain that you should want. This brain is someone who has snorted cocaine for two years. This brain is someone who has given shots of heroin for 20 years. This brain right here is the use of alcohol for 25 years. And this right here is the brain that uses 12 years of marijuana. Now, I used to have a problem with drugs and smoking, so I'm just going to go ahead and put this out to you. This is a stop sign, and it says, stop and do the right thing. So what I want you to do is stop and do the right thing. Put down your joints, your bongs, your marijuana, everything. Put it away. And if you have the urge that you want to do it, now I understand that you might have withdrawals. But if you have the urge, pop some uh, Jolly Ranchers or go to the gym. Just do something and get your mind off of that. But smoking can lead you into serious trouble. Because if you smoke, you could potentially look like these people. Or, and this is an interview that Molly Cyrus had. Drugs are for idiots. And she is right. Drugs are for idiots. So, I want you to stop for good. Put down your cigarettes, your marijuana, your joints, anything. Just put it aside. Your crack, your cocaine, mollies, ecstasies, everything. Put them away. I have a chart right here that I drew up for you. In 2007 to 2008, 200 8,000 people, over 208,000 people, died because of drugs. And it just kept raising up higher. It just kept raising up higher and higher. In 2012, 2013, 637,000. Well, 638,000 people died from using, from the use of drugs. So, you want to put that aside because if you use drugs you could also end up like this person and being handcuffed for drugs this photo was taken two years ago he is still in jail for drugs so do you want to end up like him if you don't then put the drugs down. Go outside and shoot basketball. Just get your mind off this. Let's take a few minutes, a few seconds, and look at this photo. This was just 10 years of drugs, and she looks horrible. This is the old her in 1997.
in 2007, this is what she looked like. If you want to end up like her, then go ahead, but she's dead. She died like a week and a half ago. So, going back to my stop sign. Take a few minutes, go on the internet, and just look up pictures of people that used to do drugs. They look horrible. Some of them are worse than her. And your brain could end up like this. So listen to Miley Cyrus. Even though she looks kind of jacked up now. That's an old picture of her. But she was right. Drugs are for idiots. And now she's using drugs. So, want a brain like this? If you want a brain like this, stop smoking. Or anything. Want to look like this? I thought you didn't. Okay, good. So, take that. And... Never smoke again. See? We want you to stop smoking. Stop. In 2010-2011, over 5,000 people, I mean 500,000 people died. And in 2008, over 300,000 people died. So it went up 100,000 people every year from 2007 to 2013. This girl that I just ripped up, she did drugs from 1997 to 2007, just 10 years. She's only been alive for, she was born in like 19, late 1970s and she's dead. If you want to end up like her, go ahead and smoke and Go ahead and do drugs. If you want to live your life normal, stop smoking now and it will help you. I stopped and I'm in 10th grade. So, this can help you. Thank you for taking the time out of your life to watch my drug-free video. Now, I want you to quit drugs now. You. Quit drugs and it can help you.